Hey everyone, Danny California here. And after reviewing the last video I made about the pack, I realized that there might have been a couple of things that I wanted to clarify just so I'm not confusing everyone. Um, first of all, when I said that the only people that can be part of the pack are blockers, I meant blockers that are in bounds and in play. So if a blocker has skated out of bounds or has fallen to her knees for whatever reason, she's no longer considered a pack member. Also, when I talked about the 10-foot rule that a blocker has to be within 10 feet of a pack member to be considered a pack member herself, the example that I used only showed players lining up in front of the pack by 10 feet, and I just wanted to make sure that everyone knew I meant 10 feet in any direction. You can be 10 feet in front of a pack member, behind them, to the side, whatever. That 10 feet extends all the way around a pack member. And finally, if you didn't get that Highlander reference because you've never seen the movie Highlander, we kind of can't be friends. That movie is amazeballs. It's from the 80s, it's super dated, uh, the soundtrack is by Queen. It's got Sean Connery in it, who plays an Egyptian slash Spaniard, only he still speaks with his Sean Connery Scottish accent the whole time, so to make up for it they just like give him a super tan and put some eyeliner on him and dress him up like Hernando Cortez and that's supposed to make up for it. And if I had to describe the plot, it would be that there's a race of immortals running around trying to chop each other's heads off so they can be the last man standing. Yeah, that pretty much covers it. So, hope that cleared everything up. It's like they're playing musical chairs, but instead of trying to be the last one that has a chair, they're trying to be the last one that has a head.